ninja. His strength and swiftness have become legend. Yet even the ninja knows all things must hide from the hurricane. Hurricane Honda. It will come in the spring of the new year. This is the ultimate test of an all-new Honda sport machine. The second generation of the world's most popular sport bike. This is Honda Heritage on the line. A machine that confirms Honda's commitment to sport motorcycles. The kind of commitment this man knows. A man who fought back from the brink. A legend, Bubba Schobert. On a machine he helped develop. A machine that redefines a standard for middleweight sport bikes. The all-new Honda CBR 600 F2. Totally redesigned for 1991, the CBR 600 F2 was built with a single purpose, performance, the highest in its class. Powered by an all-new double overhead cam, 16-valve, 599cc, 100-horsepower engine, a newly designed one-piece cylinder crankcase assembly, and a revised camshaft drive layout make it the lightest, most compact engine in its class. Direct shim under bucket valve actuation ensures high RPM reliability, while redesigned 34-millimeter flat slide carburetors provide superb throttle response. And there's more. A six-speed close ratio transmission, a stainless steel exhaust system, and lightweight pistons and connecting rods. There's never been a 600cc engine this advanced. With an all-new twin spar steel frame, one that ensures precise pinpoint handling, with an adjustable 41 millimeter front fork, and a revised Pro-Link rear suspension with spring preload and rebound damping adjustability. Lightweight RC30 type wheels carry high quality Michelin radial tires for superb grip. And redesigned dual disc brakes in front and a single disc in back for crisp braking. And when it comes time to make time between points A and B, the F2 obliges. With all new bodywork for superb wind and weather protection and less drag. A revised seat peg bar relationship and a wide ergonomically designed seat that's plush enough for day-long rides, even two up. The CBR 600 F2 is packed with features, like a liquid-cooled oil cooler for optimum engine performance and long engine life, a digital ignition system and automatic cam chain tensioner for easy maintenance. With performance and looks like this, you can't go wrong. Years of development, untold miles of testing, by some of the best names in the business. The 1991 CBR 600 F2 is in a class by itself. This year, it's the one to ride, the one to lead. CBR 600 F2. It's already the most popular 600 on the road. And for two straight years, it's been the fastest 600 on the track. Now it's time for the Honda CBR 600 F3 to open up its lead. Let's boost the horsepower by lowering friction and increasing intake efficiency. Completely redesign the front and rear suspension for even better handling, something few people even think is possible. 
In the hands of Honda engineers, even a front fender can be tweaked and refined to improve aerodynamics and to combat high-speed lift. When you push back the envelope of performance, brakes can't be left behind. This year, the triple discs are lighter than ever. And we've borrowed a little refinement from the racetrack. Our new rear cowl looks sleek and ready to cut through the wind. It makes the CBR 600 F3 look even faster. With a sports machine like this, you'll never want to stop. A more comfortable seat means you can keep on going. And if you feel like a racer, show the world. You can ride the same colors as the National 600 Super Sport Champion or the awesome Aryan Racing Team. Or brand new for 1997, you can have your CBR 600 F3 in our favorite color, Honda Red. Is the new Honda CBR 600 F3 still the best 600 in the world? Is it even better than last year's? Ask Miguel what he's going to ride in 1997. Team Honda's Ben Bostrom, one of the hottest road racers on the circuit today, takes on someone very special. Eric Bostrom, his younger brother. This is one of the most intense sibling rivalries that motorcycle racing has ever seen. And together, they're going to show what makes the all-new CBR 600 F4 the best CBR 600 ever. Going down, Eric. Since its introduction 12 years ago, it's been one of the world's best sport bikes and one of the most popular. And Honda never stopped improving it. The first F, the revolutionary Hurricane, was followed by the class-leading F2, and it was followed by the dominant F3. Now, get ready for the best 600 ever, the 1999 F4. The new CBR 600 F4 is a completely redesigned and reworked motorcycle destined to extend the legend of this superb sport bike. The center of the new CBR 600 F4 is Honda's all-new aluminum pro frame technology. The new frame is not only 15.4 pounds lighter, it provides an extremely rigid chassis. So that new aluminum chassis just rails. With a rigid chassis comes predictability. The frame provides the platform for extraordinary handling. The new frame features a refinement never before seen on a Honda street bike, a swing arm pivot that runs through both the frame and the rear of the engine case. Inside the new frame is a new engine, a 600 inline four power plant that's been designed for maximum output. A bigger bore and shorter stroke make it rev even faster. You should be able to cut the corner quick and run away to victory. A narrower valve angle makes the cylinder heads even more compact, while the high-tech aluminum composite cylinder sleeves are inspired by our championship-winning RC45. We're just going to go flying by everyone. An all-new Ram air system. A bigger air box and bigger carbs add even more power. The new Honda F4 is an incredible motor. It just keeps on accelerating with the new Ram Air system. Honda's first direct ignition coil system places the coils right on top of the spark plugs. And the result? Immediate response. The new CBR 600 F4 features a fully adjustable suspension, front and rear with a massive new 43 millimeter front fork. Extreme three-spoke aluminum sport wheels designed to minimize unsprung weight. And new four piston caliper front brakes with nickel plated pistons for even better feel and stopping. The new 1999 Honda CBR 600 F4. More advanced than ever and more nimble weighing in at just 372.6 pounds. Like all the CBRs before it, we expect the new F4 to be number one. <laughs>
We're just gonna smoke competition next year. I'm really looking forward to it.